Okay, so welcome to the Amazon Associates tutorial. And there's a few key points that I need to point out here um, before you sign up for an account. You will notice a flag here in the top right. And that flag is going to list a bunch of different countries from United States, United Kingdom, Deutschland, France, Japan, Canada, China, Italia, Espana, India, Brazil, Mexico. So it's important that you understand what this means. And effectively, you select which country you want to use to promote Amazon products in. So if you want to promote Amazon products to people in the UK, you'll select the UK Associates Program. If you want to promote Amazon products to people in Germany, you'll select the Germany Program. If you want to promote Amazon products to people in America, you'll select the American program. So you don't sign up based on what country you live in. You sign up based on what Amazon store you want to join as an affiliate. So to explain this further, if you sign up for the United States Associates program, and you use that affiliate ID to promote products in the amazon.co.uk, which is the United Kingdom website, you won't get any credit for the sale. So what I always recommend you do is if you are building an app in German, then always sign up for the German Associates Program first. If you're building an app in French, then sign up for the France building an app in Japanese and sign up for the Japanese. If you're not sure who your main audience is going to be for your app, just sign up for the United States one. And then later on, when you install Google Analytics on your app, you're going to be able to see where the majority of users are from on your app. And then you can all, always go back and sign up for the correct associates program. So to be clear, if you know that your target audience will be based in the UK, sign up for the UK program. If you know it will be based in Italian and in Italy, then sign up for the Italia program. If you don't know who your target audience is and where they're going to be located, then just stick to America initially and down the line your analytics will come back and it'll tell you where most of your app users oriented from and then you can change it up from there. So it's really very easy to sign up for an account. We'll just click on join now for free. And if you remember your details that you used when you signed up for Amazon AWS in the previous video, use the exact same details here again now. And then just click on sign in. And it's going to ask you to confirm your details. Then just click on next your website list and here all you need to enter in is one of your websites or a blog or any site that you own that has some form of content on it and if you don't have one you can ask someone for permission if you know someone if you can use their website and um, just for this sign up procedure so i will just put in add website and then I'll click on next. Are any of these sites listed about director primary or children under 13? No. And then I'll ask you for the name of your website. Which I'll put it in. What is your website about? More apps. What are the following topics best describe the topic of your website? Business, uh, secondary. You just look through and then select the one that matches what you're doing. What time Amazon items? We'll just select. Um, the ones that sort of are relevant, it doesn't actually make a difference. What type of site is your website? So it's a blog. 
How do you drive traffic to your website? You can just select. Um, whatever ones you want to use. How do you monetize your website? You can select here if there's any other ways that you monetize your, your website. How do you build links? Unique visitors, does your website get a month? What is your primary reason? How did you hear about us? And then you enter in the details. The reason why I just went through all that there is just to be clear with people. Um, so you're aware of what you see and the questions you get and not to get too worried about it. You just answer um, as they are and there's no problem. Click on next. Again, it's going to enter in my telephone number to verify who I am. You need to include your country code as well, and it should start with a plus. As I'm in the UK, it's 44. And I've had my pin verified, so I agree. Click and finish. And there it will give me my unique associates ID. Then you can enter your payment and tax information now or later. So this is important to read. Your application will be reviewed shortly after you referred your first sale to Amazon. If your affiliate links have not referred a sale after 180 days, your application and access to Associates Central will be withdrawn. So when you make your first sale within 180 days, which you will, then you just need to, your account will be reviewed and it'll be cleared and it'll be, and you'll have access to the associates program permanently. But in the meantime, it all works completely fine. If you want, you can enter in your tax payment inf payment and tax information now, or you can just do later. So that ID here, it's very important that you copy it. We'll move back across the Zappable and we'll paste it in. And then finally, it's very important that you click on Product Advertising API. Click on Sign Up Now. Then enter in the same login details, the same one you use for AWS, the same one you use for your Associates program. It's important that they all match. Click Sign In. It's gonna ask you for some information. Just put it in. And then you just click on, click here. Enter in the code. Click on complete registration. Just thank you, you've created a new product, product advertising API account. You may now use a product advertising API. So that is the final step. And on the next video, I'm going to show you how to test your details to make sure they're correct. Once that is verified, you're going to be able to add Amazon products. I'd just like to remind you that you only need to do all these steps once. You can use the same access and secret key and associates ID if you create another app. Make sure you store them away safely.